Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can assign material resources to tasks in order to note project costs associated with the use or consumption of a material resource in order to accomplish a task. Remember that material resource types do not perform any work and therefore will not affect task durations in the way that work resource assignment does. You can assign material resources in the same manner that you add work resources. You can either add them through the Assign Resources dialog box or by entering them directly into the Task Form view that appears at the bottom of the Gantt chart view when the window is split. You can open the Assign Resources dialog box by selecting the task in the Gantt chart view to which you want to assign the use of material resources and then clicking the Assign Resources button that appears in the Assignments group on the Resource tab in the ribbon, or pressing Alt plus the F10 key on your keyboard. You can then enter the number of units of material that were used on this task by assigning the particular resource, and then simply entering the units used in the Units column. Now doing this will automatically assign the material resources and units to the selected task. So you can click the close button in the assign resources dialog box to close the dialog box once you're finished. Alternately, you can click into the next blank row under the resource name column for the selected task that appears in the task form view of the Gantt chart view, and then choose the name of the material to use and enter the units to use. You can then click the OK button to save your changes. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.